Hey Astro fans, old and new. Today we're taking a request from some of our new Astro fans and that is, what is a neutron star? In a literal sense, a neutron star is a star that is about 20 kilometers across, two to three times as massive as our sun, and is made entirely of neutrons, hence the name. Now this makes it incredibly heavy because everything else is made of atoms and in those atoms you have a nucleus at the center which will have some neutrons in, some protons, and then you'll have a vast amount of space and then you'll have electrons whirling around. Now one of the famous analogies of trying to get your sort of brain to grips with just how big this scale of nothingness is it is, I think it's imagine a grain of sand in the centre of a cathedral. And that is how much space is around between the centre of an atom, the nucleus, the thing that makes up most of the mass, and the few little electrons that are floating around and whizzing around it. That is a lot of empty space, which, I mean, when you pick up a brick or your breakfast or something else, it feels heavy. Imagine all that emptiness being squashed out and having just neutrons. That is what a neutron star is. But of course we should talk about what a neutron star really is, like where does it come from, what, what does it mean? And in that sense it is the remnants of a dead star, which sounds very poetic, but let's find out more. A neutron star typically comes from a star that was maybe 10 to 30 times as massive as our sun, and once they stop burning all of their hydrogen fuel, and they no longer have any outward pressure to hold themselves out from all the gravity collapsing in. It's called a type two supernova to get to a neutron star or a black hole. Depends how big your star is. If you want more detail, head over to my supernova video, which if I'm pointing at the right corner, one of those corners, then you can click and find it and find out more. Question. So like, um, are all neutron stars the same? No offense to any Americans whatsoever. Uh, what else could I do? Uh, so. Are all neutron stars the same, Josie? Oh, good question. That, you, you know, maybe the whole video will stay in this voice. No, it won't. Stop it, Josie. Not all neutron stars are the same. Some of them are different. Some of them have got really strong magnetic fields and they are called magnetars. And then ones that you may have heard of more are ones called pulsars. A pulsar is a neutron star that is beaming out radiation. In the galaxy, you've got loads of neutron stars, loads of pulsars. And when these beams pass by you, you obviously you observe that radiation. And the thing is with pulsars, they are so accurate in terms of their timing that you can use them as space clocks because it takes so long for them to lose any energy that you know that you're gonna see that next blip in 1.3 milliseconds or longer or shorter. In fact, if you take the observations, so when the neutron star sort of sweeps past us like a lighthouse, it almost sounds just like a ticking, which if I've been clever, I will insert here. Ah, yes, wonderful, neutron star sound, pulsar, great. So they can be used to do a lot of really cool astronomy. There are whole huge groups of astronomers that work just on pulsars. I will be coming back, but if you have questions, then please tweet me at Josie A. Peters or find me on Facebook at facebook.com forward slash Josie A. Peters. Ah, oh, I see a theme, I see a theme. Or leave it in the comment section below. Why not? It's the easiest place to go. You're already here. Until next time, keep being curious. Hey, hey, we're still recording. Hey, Hi. come in. Featuring Hi. Dawn. Hello, everybody. Hi. Hi. <laughs> oh, you all look so well. Oh, gosh, look at that radiant. Oh, radiant. Oh, radiant. What a day. Ooh, like yes. a star. Like a star. Yes. Is that, is that what you wanted to be say for the link thing? Is yeah, yeah, yeah. Sweet. Okay. Thanks, Dawn. This is Dawn. Hi. Dawn, hey. She's great. Dawn's really cool. Yeah. <laughs> Bye. Bye. <laughs> Love, you. Love, you. Love you. Love you. Love you. Love you. Well, Love that's you. special, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Ha <laughs>